Number 1. The climax of Dragon Wings occurred when A. Windrider brought his wife to America B. Moonshadow rescued earthquake victims C. Windrider flew the airplane D. Black Dog robbed Moonshadow Number 2. Where did most of Dragon Wings take place? A. In the Middle Kingdom B. In the San Francisco Bay Area C. In and around Los Angeles D. Aboard a ship crossing the Pacific 3. The literary genre to which Dragon Wings belongs is A. Historical Fiction B. Autobiography C. Contemporary History D. Fairy Tale 4. One thing Moonshadow noticed early in his relationship with Miss Whitlaw was that she A. Assumed that white people were smarter than Chinese B. Was interested in learning about people as people C. Thought she had the right answer to every question D. Was as kind and gentle as his own mother 5. Why did Moonshadow feel sorry for Black Dog? A. Black Dog longed desperately to return to China B. Black Dog was on poor terms with his mother C. Black Dog had never learned to speak the demon's language D. Black Dog was unable to see any beauty in life 6. From whose point of view was the story told? A. First person from Windrider's point of view B. Third person from Robin's point of view C. Omniscient point of view D. First person from Moonshadow's point of view 7. The author indicated English words in the text by A. Putting them in bold type B. Italicizing them C. Capitalizing them D. Footnoting them 8. Windrider said that repairing the car was like healing the Dragon King and that A. A little voice in his head told him how to proceed B. The reward he received was greater than gold C. His hands just seemed to know what to do D. He proved his powers beyond a doubt 9. Why did Uncle have a pleased look in his eye after the company discussed how to pay off Black Dog's crimes? A. He was convinced Black Dog would not repeat his mistakes. B. He could afford the interest rate the company offered him. C. He was happy that the company insisted on sharing the costs. D. He realized he would not have to sell the laundry. 10. When Robin told Moonshadow that Jack was afraid of the sight of blood, the reader can infer that she A. Was explaining why Jack had fainted when Robin got a bloody nose. B wanted to give Moonshadow a hint as to how to take revenge on Jack. C. Wanted Moonshadow to realize that Jack was not perfect. D. Was explaining why Jack was not likely to help them rescue earthquake victims. 11. Why did Lefty sit by Moonshadow in Windrider's door the night after Black Dog beat and robbed Moonshadow? A. He was afraid Windrider would get in trouble by seeking revenge. B. He wanted to be sure Black Dog did not return and hurt Moonshadow further. C. He thought Windrider might attack Uncle to avenge Moonshadow. D. He thought Moonshadow and Windrider needed quiet time alone. 12. Why did Father lack spirit as he helped rebuild the company after the earthquake? A. He felt his dreams had vanished when the laundry collapsed. B. He knew the demons would eventually drive the company farther south. C. He was troubled by the lack of cooperation among family members. D. He was longing for the freedom he would feel if he could fly. 13. Which of the following would be the most likely to happen if the story continued? A. Windrider and Moonshadow would open a business with Miss Whitlaw and Robin. B. Moonshadow's mother would come to America and they would live happily. C. Windrider would decide to remain in China and send for Moonshadow. D. Moonshadow would be unable to adjust to his mother and would live apart from his parents. 14. What effect did the earthquake have on Miss Whitlaw? A. She took a job as a housekeeper in Oakland. B. She became a nurse with the Red Cross. C. She contacted Windrider's family to say he needed help. D. She began a relationship with Moonshadow and Windrider.
15. How did Moonshadow's father acquire the name of Windrider? A. Miss Whitlaw thought it was fitting. B. The Dragon King called him by that name. C. Moonshadow suggested it based on his kite building skill. D. It reflected his dream of flying an aeroplane. 16. What prevented Windrider from being shot when he challenged Black Dog to fight him? A. Windrider ducked when Moonshadow shouted. B. Moonshadow threw himself against the gunman. C. The Tiger General commanded the gunman to halt. D. Black Dog backed down at the last minute. 17. Moonshadow and Windrider thought they were going to lose dragon wings when A. They needed to use all their money for an operation for Miss Whitlaw. B. A severe storm struck the stable in which the plane was hanging. C. They had to move and could not find a wagon to carry the plane. D. Strong winds battered the plane during its maiden flight. 18. Moonshadow and Windrider were fairly safe during the earthquake because they A. Stayed at the park B. Stood in the door frame of the stable C. Were in a wide open space D. Were in Miss Whitlaw's sturdy house 19. Why did Moonshadow want to explain what he knew about dragons to Miss Whitlaw? A. He thought perhaps he and she had been close in a former life B. He believed the good dragons would protect her if she believed in them. C. He was afraid the dragon gods would be angry with him if he did not. D. He wanted to show Miss Whitlaw how intelligent he was. 20. How did Lefty lose his right hand? A. He caught it in the ringer of a washing machine. B. He cut it off when he lost his money gambling. C. He offered it as a sacrifice to the gods. D. A member of the sleepers cut it off as a warning. 21. What improvement did Windrider make to the Wright's original design? A. He put four wheels on the bottom. B. He was first to use a motor. C. He added a cockpit for the pilot. D. He included vertical and horizontal rudders. 22. Why did Moonshadow feel betrayed the first time he, Windrider, and Robin walked to the beach together? A. Robin made fun of the way Moonshadow spoke. B. Robin did not express any interest in their playing. C. Windrider suggested that Moonshadow had not been much help in building the plane. D. Windrider asked Robin if she wanted to help fly the plane. 23. Why did Windrider say, I gave you something for your soul, after he gave Moonshadow a gift upon his arrival? A. He had given Moonshadow a book about dragons. B. He believed that bringing Moonshadow to America offered Moonshadow the chance to be free. C. He was apologizing for the fact that he could not afford to give Moonshadow an expensive gift. D. He was comparing the kite he gave Moonshadow with the practical clothing the others gave him. 24. Windrider became convinced that he could build an aeroplane when A. He had the experience of flying with the Dragon King B. He was able to fix Mr. Alger's automobile C. He read that the Wright brothers flown one D. Miss Whitlaw and Robin expressed their amazement at his kites 25. When he first arrived in America, Moonshadow thought the demons lived like prisoners without knowing they were in a prison because they A. Did not believe in anything they could not see B. Were afraid to leave the demon's city C. Lived in drab little box-like houses D. Seemed to care only about money 26. What did Moonshadow decide was the real mountain of gold? A. The aeroplane that Windrider had built. B. The love of his mother and father. C. Equal educational opportunities for all races. D. People like the Whitlaws and the company. 27. Which of the following is an opinion rather than a fact about Black Dog? A. He took the money Moonshadow and Windrider needed to pay rent. B. He died in Sacramento before he reached the opium den. C. He gave Moonshadow a knife as his welcoming gift. D. 
D. He became an opium addict because he missed China. 28. What is a Q as used in the story? A. A robe worn in Chinese religious ceremonies. B. An offering made to the Dragon King. C. A hair braid worn by Chinese men. D. A tail tied to the end of a kite. 29. When Moonshadow said they cannibalized dragon wings, he meant they A. Pulled it up the hill using the wagon. B. Burned it after it crashed. C. Broke a ball of wine on its frame. D. Used pieces of it to make a stretcher. 30. How did Uncle and the elders persuade the demons to allow the Tong people's town to be rebuilt in its original location after the earthquake? A. They paid off city officials with opium. B. They threatened to leave the city completely. C. They suggested the Brotherhood would cause trouble. D. They volunteered to reduce the laundry's prices. 31. Members of the company persuaded Uncle to leave the Tong town after the earthquake by saying that A. Moonshadow would be safer elsewhere. B. His help was needed at the park. C. They were all staying if he stayed. D. The fire was spreading in their direction. 32. What is the main idea of dragon wings? A. The San Francisco earthquake brought different cultures together. B. A Chinese immigrant boy helped his father fulfill his dream. C. An opium addict paid with his life for his addiction. D. A mother sacrificed so that her son could have a better life. Vocabulary 33. Old Deerfoot worked in a mansion a few blocks away from Moonshadow and his father. What is a mansion? A. A large busy factory. B. A big grand residence. C. A professional laundry. D. A restaurant kitchen. 34. The Dragon King said that Father had been the greatest physician of the dragons in a former life. Former means A. Pretend B. Magical C. Past D. Simpler 35. The Wright brothers enclosed diagrams in their letter to Moonshadow. What are diagrams? A. Plans or drawings that show how things work or are put together B. Old photographs C. Timelines or schedules that list dates for finishing projects. D. Encouraging words. 36. The street that Miss Whitlaw took to the park was clear of holes and rubble. What does rubble mean? A. Gangs of tough, mean teenagers. B. Paper trash scattered over a wide area. C. Deep ruts caused by frequent use. Or D. Broken fragments of a destroyed building. 37. When Lefty and Miss Whitlaw met, Miss Whitlaw smiled and looked at Father to translate. To translate means to A. Give specific directions B. Interrupt a conversation C. Put words in a different language or D. Introduce one person to another. 38. After the second tremor, the tenement house seemed to shudder and then collapse. To collapse means to A. Fade out B. Blow up C. Cave in. D. Catch fire. 39. Black Dog reached under his tunic for the demon's steel knife. What is a tunic? A. A broad, a wide, braided belt. B. A low, fold-away bed. C. A long, loose shirt. D. A soft pillow chair. 40. The demoness had dragons that killed for malicious fun. Malicious means A. Necessary B. Showing envy C. Plain D. Intending harm 41. Moonshadow said that a demon could be any of a number of supernatural creatures. If something is supernatural, it is A. Possessing very great strength B. Existing outside the normal world C. Dangerous D. Enormous 42. Uncle was fond of the phrase, the superior man, which he had borrowed from Confucius. Which phrase describes the meaning of superior? A. Of higher quality. B. Working. C. From another country. D. Normal. 